Okay, so we have a company called Leisure Timber Products. And it looks like they make uh, summer houses and sheds and, I don't know, fencing maybe, all that kind of stuff. So let's have a look, see what we can see. Well, it looks like they've got a lot of uh, timber here. Hell of a lot of timber products. But I can see from here, this, uh, this yard goes back a long, 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 long way. Um, I drove past it on the road and it is a absolute massive yard. So it looks like somebody's coming to have a chat with me at the minute. How you doing? Oh, you know, steady. You are sorry? You're glad somebody is? Yeah. <laughs> Why, aren't you? No. Why? Overworked and underpaid. You what, sorry? Overworked and underpaid. Overworked and underpaid? Yeah. All right, that can't be good, that. That's the way it is before. It's a massive yard you've got here, isn't it? Yeah. I'm getting busy. So you do summer houses, sheds, fencing? We don't do fencing. You don't do fencing? Garden buildings. You what, sorry? Garden buildings. Garden buildings, so sheds, summer houses. Log cabins, yeah. Log cabins. Awesome. It's a bloody big company, isn't it? I take it they go out as like sort of flat pack. Yeah. And then they built up on site. Yeah. Marvellous. All over the country? No, just a 30 mile radius. You what, sorry? Just a 30 mile radius where we are. An eight, 80 mile? 30. 30 mile. Is that all? Yeah. Bloody hell, you must have a lot of customers, because, like I say, your yard is absolutely massive. Yeah, it is, yeah. Are you filming for the reason, or do you need any help? No, I don't need any help. I'd love to come and have a look round. Is that possible? Not really. What's it regarding? I just make videos. People enjoy watching my videos about different companies and all that kind of stuff, you know, what people do, what they manufacture, and the diversity, really, of industry within See, the local area. Room at the front. Where's that? I'll meet you around there. It's just this is just going to film you. Just go again. So if you just walk there, yeah. You know where the fire station is? I've seen the tower. Just opposite. All right. Oh, I'll come around there and have a look. Check around there. All right. But yeah, it's a massive place, isn't it? How long you worked here then? Uh, I own it. Oh, you own it. Yeah. You're the man, are you? Yeah, one of them. Yeah, there's two of us. Oh, you say brothers? No, just friends. All right. Do you want to just? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, somebody knows me, look. Yeah. I'm all right, Doc, are you? Yeah, I go. I just said I'd go. Do us a favour, do us a favour. Take him round, or you can walk across there. Do you want to do some filming? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Do some filming? Aye, good, eh? Yeah, but I'm just in case. Shit, but if you want to scrap up, we've got garden bars, garden rooms. Yeah, Magic, yeah. Fill around in the show, but make this. All right, then. We'll have a walk around. Right, so I've just spoke to Ian uh, on that last clip, and he actually owns a company with a, a friend of his. And this young man at side of me, Ryan, is going to take me around and uh, show me around the showroom, aren't you, Ryan? I am, yes. There you go. Can't beat service like that, can you? No. Okay, so I'm here with Ryan. What do, what do you actually do here, Ryan? Uh, we. Uh, you yourself? I mean myself, forklift driver. Yeah, fork truck driver. Timber. All right. Yeah, I dip it in, in tanks. All right, you dip the timber in the tanks. That's yeah, yeah. preservative, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. so we've got here, looks a bit like a cycle shed or something with a bit of a summer house at side of it. Very nice. And then we've got, you can see they're really good quality buildings, these. Nice, really nice timber sheds. Once again, you can see with the timber on them, they're, uh, they're all good quality. Everything's marvellous. Have you got some inside yeah, as well? Yeah. All right, well, we'll go and have a look inside, see what else they've got. Oh, I like the chair. I could just sit outside on that and have a cup of coffee in the morning when the sun's shining. Not at the moment, though. And a nice big 
picnic bench. Oh wow, what a shed to have in your garden this one is. Look at that. It's like a little summer house, isn't it? I don't ask how much they are. <laughs> but look at that, that's amazing. Music shed. All right, okay. Got a music shed here. So you can come in here and uh, play the drums or whatever it is you want to do, keyboards. Talking about drums, my neighbour come knocking on the door at four o'clock this morning. Today. That's a good job I was still up playing drums, isn't it? <laughs> right. It's a bit dark, but you can see all the God, it must be nice to have a, a garden big enough to have something like this in. Yeah. 5.7 metres by 3.8. Oh, and it, oh, look at this. You can put a hot tub in there. Look, I suppose you could do that with the one outside as well. Yeah, yeah. Hot tub and then... Master. There you go. Go and get spagged out when you've been in hot tub. <laughs> put a fridge in there, keep your beer cool and you'll be cooking on gas. Bit of a spot. Yeah, some nice patio furniture. Oh, look, you can have a gym. <laughs> All sorts of uses for them. What's in that, through that door then? This is uh, like an outhouse shed. All right. So it's a storage thing, put yeah. your bikes and things like that in. Yeah. 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 Oh, here you go, look. Outdoor eating. Yeah, outdoor eating, so you can have your meals outside, barbecue there, look. With open bar. Oh, with a bar as well. A fully stocked bar. I think them bottles are empty though, aren't they? No, they're all full. Oh, they're all full, <laughs> are they? Oh, dear. Yeah. You can have a good time in there, then. Obviously, music, but another bar. Yeah. Nail salon. All right, yeah. All sorts of uses. Yeah, and then another bar. Another, oh, look at that, eh? Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Would you like to walk outside? Nice bit of deck in there. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. And this is where all the hard work's done, is it? Yeah, yeah. So I take it that you've got um, frames that you work to? Yeah, yeah. Like uh, jigs. Like yeah. a jig, yeah. That's the word I was searching for. Yeah. These are what have been made in the last day or two. Right. So when these get sold, you'll take them down yeah. and flat pack them. And chuck them on a wagon and off they go. And then, like so the do you erect them when you get when they get on site? Yeah. And then they're like the big ones in there, these are all in packs here. Oh they're all ready to go? Yeah, all flat packs. Right, okay, so that is one of these that we've seen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're all ready to get loaded on a vehicle and off they go and then the, and yeah. then when they get there they're they're put up by your people. Yeah, yeah. Okay, no. If they need a base laying, can you lay the base all as well? Bases, all bases and uh, everything. So you do everything, wire them in, yeah. plumbing if it needs it, stock the bar up with booze. <laughs> <laughs> Marvellous, absolutely fantastic. Would you like to have a look around the yard? As long as it's all right with yeah, Gaffer. Yeah, yeah. So this is all the different types of timber that you this use? This is all different types of timber. All this is customer stuff and all this is our stuff for eBay and uh, etc. Alright, oh so you sell on eBay as well do yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh very good. From one length to as many lengths you want. So you don't just sell the, the buildings on no. eBay, you sell the timber sell the on eBay timber as well. Alright, okay. Walk down this side.
And this is all, is this decking? Uh, this is a uh, ship lap, a lap. Right. So what's that used for? Uh, for sheds or... All right, yeah, yeah. And then we've got decking coming up. Oh, right, yeah, that's good timber, isn't it? Yeah. It's a roofing buttons. You do roofing buttons? Yeah. So you sell to the construction industry as well then, yeah. do you? Yeah. Very good. You've got a lot of money's worth of... Oh, I love that smell of uh, fresh cut timber. Yeah. Is that your machine then? Uh, yeah. This is the man who makes decking and everything in the yard. All right. And this smaller. Just for that. So what's that machine doing? Hey, that is a, uh, it's putting in rough, rough wood and he's bringing it out and it's coming out now all planes and everything. All right, so and then that, that pipe in there, that takes all sawdust yeah, away. that takes it straight into a trailer that can be sent. Yeah. To be sent away for animals. So, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've done them trailers before. Yeah. You know, it's all this one. I can imagine that gets a bit monotonous after a while, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So on the machine, you can set the width and the, the height and everything for the timbers. Yeah. All the time, it's constantly, yeah. A bit of uh, soda floating around, it's like it's snowy. Marvellous. Would you like to see? This is all the stuff he's doing now at the minute. All right. How nice to finish the nap. Yeah. So what's that going to get used for? Sheds. Sheds and uh, probably uh, fencing. All right. Very good. Take your fill and do you want to see where we dip them? Where you dip them? Yeah. yeah. I've seen you've got like a big tent there. Yeah. Is that where you do it? Yeah. So how long you worked here then, Ryan? I've worked here since uh, May last year. All right. Yeah. You like it? Yeah, I love it. Yeah. <laughs> I've just passed out this morning for both tannerizers. For what, sorry? To run both machines. All right, right. So you're now qualified to operate yeah. them, are you? Very good. Are you a local lad? Yeah, all go. Oh, you're, in, you're, you're ghoulish, are you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let me just come that side of you, because... I've got sun behind you and it, it spoils, your, spoils your picture. Can't see how good looking you are, you see. <laughs> so how many people work here then? Roughly. Nine. Oh, not a lot then. No, no, no. No, just nine of us. All right, that's including Gaffer. There's two of them. Two of them. Yeah. Yeah, seems a, a right nice bloke. What's she say? No, Ian, did you Ian, say? Yeah. yeah, seems a right nice bloke. Down to earth, and because oh, yeah. uh, some of them get right stressed. As soon as you see a camera, they get right yeah. stressed, as well, you know, because you've watched my videos. Yeah. Well, I've just sat having a cup of it. They said someone's at gate with a camera in a, got dreadlocks in the red coat. I, I know that fella. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Well, I've just come back from Egypt and I got recognised in Egypt three times. Did you? Yeah. Crazy, yeah, isn't it? that video with driving. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Some crazy one. Oh, crazy, man. Really is. No lights, no crashes. Even ambulance were driving around with no lights yeah. on. Absolutely crackers. So, where does all your timber come from? Uh, Russia and uh, Germany. Right, I've, I have, only a couple of times, picked them up off at docks at Hull. Oh, yeah. And, 
driven them about and delivered them. Well, this one makes a uh, yellow tin there. Right. For indoors only. Right. And the black tank is an high pressure tank that uh, does outside gear, etc. your sheds and Right, everything. okay. I've seen high pressure ones before, but they were, the one I saw was more like a, uh, a shipping container. Yeah, yeah. So the timber goes in here. Yeah. I take it the doors are closed at both ends. Both ends, yeah. And then it, have you got some kind of spraying equipment in there that sprays it all? Yeah, you go into the control room, just press start, and 40 minutes later it's done. So what does it, does it actually fill the tank or fill does it? Fills the tank to full. Yeah, it, it fills it full. Yeah, it right. It. And then it obviously recycles it yeah. back through into the tank. And then. And it then, goes then down that, yeah. Yeah. And then, like I say, this high pressure, because this is low pressure, Yeah. it's only 40 minutes. The high pressure, that's one hour and 40 minutes. What kind of pressure do you have inside that? 12 and a half bar. 12 and a half bar, so a fair bit then? Yeah, yeah. So that about concludes the tour, and my friend here is going to escort me to the gate, and he can't wait now to see himself on YouTube, I yeah, imagine. Sir. Thank <laughs> you very much, <laughs> Yes, it looks an interesting place to work. It doesn't look like it's same old, same old every day, oh, you no. know, a bit monotonous and doing the same thing all the time. No, different every day. And that's what makes a job good, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, if you're in a job that's monotonous and you're doing the same thing all the time, it's, it, it's mind blowing. Oh, it's, it's not my kind of thing. That's why I enjoy doing what I do. It's, some days you meet good people and some days yeah, you meet, yeah you know but absolute numpties but now he's it's definitely return he'll get the same atmosphere again yeah 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 ah is that's the docks over there then is it yeah docks is just over this fly over all right yeah yeah well yeah. i might go and have a look at docks then yeah you've got rms global northwest trading I imagine there's quite a bit down here, isn't there? Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I'll have a walk like down say, there first. Go to where we just come in. Yeah. You've got Tom Chambers across the road. Go a bit further down, you've got your Jewsons, etc. Oh, All right, okay. DNC. Get to end where T Junction is. Go that way, you've got Chemical Factory, a freezer factory. Jewsons hate me videoing them. <laughs> they really do, honestly. Every time I go near a Jewson place, they go mad. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, thank you for your time, my no, friend. No problem. Oh. And we'll yeah. see you soon. Yeah, thank you. All right, thank Bye. you very much, and say thank you very much to Ian for me. Yeah, I will do. No All right. Problem. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. Well, what a wonderful place. What a wonderful people. Pretty more out like this, isn't it? So that ends this video. If you've enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please share, please subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.